Until now, Russia's occupation of Ukraine has mostly focused on the progress on the ground. However, a significant part of the war takes place in the air, and both sides are trying to control the airspace. Ukrainian leader Zelensky demanded that Western countries declare a no-fly zone over their airspace against Russian attacks since the beginning of the invasion. However, no decision was made in this direction. Ukraine initially suffered heavy losses in its air defense systems, but many experts nevertheless found the resistance against Russia impressive. Oryx, the open-source military analysis website that tracks military casualties since the start of the war, found that Ukraine had captured or destroyed at least 82 Russian aircraft, helicopters and drones.